Hi, my name is Richard Regrag from the Qualcomm Data Technology Centers Engineering, and this is the Reference Evaluation Platform. It has two CRV systems that you just saw earlier, um, mounted in a 1U form factor. So right there are the chipsets. These are the two chipsets mounted here. A whole bunch of RAM? That's right. Um, uh, six channels for our, uh, on each side, a dual channel DDR. And uh, network interface here, we're at Mellanox booth. So we had the Mellanox. Right, and here's the CX5 card that uh, we use for the network interface. And uh, so, so you're from Mellanox, sure. right? Mellanox. So who are you? So I'm Scott Schultz. I manage a lot of the HPC and artificial intelligence activities here at Mellanox. And uh, you work together with Qualcomm to do this solution right here, right? Yeah, absolutely. So, you know, uh, the industry is really excited uh, about ARM, and it's, it's actually becoming a, a potential solution for a lot of HPC applications. Um, and, and of course, it's no different than any other platform that would require a, a, a CPU offload architecture uh, from a network perspective. So, uh, so right here you have your network card to make super fast networking. Exactly, and so this is uh, the card, um, you know, kind of outside the box. It, it definitely is. Um, it's a Connect X5. It's a dual port a card. This is 100 gigabits a second, right? But it'll support uh, Gen 3 as well as Gen 4. It's a by 16 card. Um, uh, it has um, all of the collectives, tag matching, and MPI offload capabilities to remove um, uh, latency from uh, uh, rendezvous type um, operations. Uh, we have a support for in-network computing and all of the um, uh, storage for NVMe offloads and, and whatnot. So this is this is the this is the de facto standard for HPC and machine learning. This is the same card that goes into the DOE systems that were just recently announced that we're all excited and waiting for. But uh, again, you know, there's a lot of interest across the industry for very high performance ARM solutions, and uh, we feel that the Connect X5 paired up with the Qualcomm is, is, a, is a very exciting solution. So how's the performance for this solution? It's huge. It's a rock star. What are you talking about? <laughs> it's, it's a rock star. So, uh, because you're in uh, 10 nanometers, right? Uh, the, uh, the people are very excited about this. It's very high performance. The performance is really good. Uh, we've got performance parity and we've got performance advantage, but uh, our story is a TCO story. Uh, performance per watt is extremely good. And uh, you, uh, Qualcomm has been working for many generations of uh, custom for smartphones, right? Absolutely. So there's this knowledge of doing custom that helps you with this one too. There's a custom design. That's correct. This is a fifth generation microarchitecture from Qualcomm. Uh, integrated and all the experience that we've learned about designing for low power is integrated into this chip and that's why um, a lot of our differentiation for the uh, performance per watt is very significant. And uh, uh, it's been a smooth uh, ride so thus far to work on the software, everything to work to get in the ARM ecosystem? A absolutely. We've, uh, actually, actually at Mellanox we've been working with uh, ARM, ARM technology for quite some time. And we've been enabled and ready with all of the core offload capabilities uh, for for uh, several years, actually. So um, the it's previous generations of different, different providers. Um, yeah, right. Exactly. So ARM, ARM technology has come a long way in the last several years, right? So um, I feel personally, right, that this is going to be a, a very um, compelling solution, um, especially when you couple it with the with the latest and greatest interconnect technology.